the way that we learn mathematics recapitulates everything that mathematicians over the centuries and even the millennia figured out. We learn mathematics from thousands of years ago in primary school, algebra in middle school, geometry, and then all of a sudden, finally, by the time you get to high school, we're in the 1600s and learning calculus. The moment when students reach calculus is a, uh, is a really exciting one. In some ways it's a culmination of all of the work that they've done. Calculus is really a big turning point in the history of mathematics with Newton and Leibniz around 1665. Isaac Newton realized that what was going on out there in the planets was also the secret to the mechanics of what was happening on Earth. Leibniz related the ideas of calculus to measuring changes. We use both of their perspectives. End. So the part of this I think calculus is one moment in which everything comes together. Any action involves change. Position, size, velocity. The sciences and in engineering and even the social sciences, the things that you study, they change. It applies to many situations. GPS in economics, medicine, astrophysics. Well, this is going to sound really nerdy, but if the restaurant promises you a 12-inch pizza and it's really only about 11.8 inches, without using a calculator, you can use calculus and get the percent area you've been ripped off by. There's a lot of doing calculus in this class. We're never just going to talk math at you. We have lots of visual interactives that we think really help construct your understanding of calculus in a deep way. And the combination of uh, examples and theory and interaction between the two, I think it's a, a typical aspect of the education at MIT. The response for the much more complex... A lot of students see the AP calculus as this hurdle for getting into college. But why is that hurdle even there? Because calculus is fundamental to everything that comes after it. So we're really hoping to help get students onto the other side where they're excited about what comes next after calculus, thinking of it as the beginning, not the end. Rocco, sit if you like derivatives. <gasps>